New for 2023, the Flare Neo Flex offers you two ways to brew for under $100. The Red Flow Control Portafilter is your ticket to easy espresso. The Black Bottomless Portafilter gives you full control of your brew. To get started, connect the lever assembly to the base. Affix the preheat cap to the cylinder, fill with freshly boiled water and leave to soak. Add 15 grams or up to 3 tablespoons of ground coffee into the red basket. Settle the grounds and then tamp them down. Place the screen on top and insert the basket onto the brew base. Dump out the preheat water from the cylinder and slide it on top. Fill the chamber to the etched line with freshly boiled water, then insert the piston. Pull down on the lever until you see a steady flow of espresso and maintain it until the lever is fully lowered. To clean up, first run cold water over the brew head. Invert it and twist as you pull apart. Knock out the grounds, rinse the coffee basket as well as the pressurization compartment, and place upside down on a rack. Use a tamper to push the piston back up and out. If you need more leverage, press it into the counter instead of your hand. Leave the brew components to air dry. If you have a burr grinder that grinds fine enough for espresso, dial in the correct resistance by grinding progressively finer. For more advice on how to brew with the bottomless portafilter, watch our guide for the Flare Classic. While the black basket will need a very fine grind, the red basket requires one that is slightly coarser to function properly. If you cannot complete the shot, hold the cylinder down with your free hand as you slowly ease up on the lever to prevent the cylinder from lifting. If the tip clogs, run fresh water through the brew head. You can also try to clear it with a small needle or toothbrush. If unable to free the blockage, swap in the spare tip that shipped with your flex. The piston comes with two red training burst discs and one solid black graduation disc. The foil seal on the burst disc will rupture when excessive force is used, allowing water to pass through. Remove the ruptured disc by prying it up at the recess. Replace with the second training disc or swap in the graduation disc when ready. The training disc should be used until you are confident that the force applied to the lever is never excessive. The Flex is compatible with our newly designed pressure gauge kit, which can be distinguished from the old design by the angle formed at the top of the stem. The new design accommodates the wider lever of the Flex. If you'd like to see how to brew with one of our other models, select that guide now.